Hello folks, this is Jamil Surfer Gunstruck Reviews. We're here at C2 Tactical in Scottsdale, Arizona, our favorite indoor facility. And we're going to do some range time with the Stoger STR-9S Combat. Uh, there was a video that I introduced all the three com uh, Stoger pistols that I was introduced to last May at Gunsight. Uh, the Combat, the Compact, and the Subcompact. Well, this one is a Combat. To just to recap real quickly, I'm not going to give you the whole spiel. Um, interchangeable back straps originally comes with a mag weld that I misplaced. That was me. Adjustable rear sights with fiber optics. Tall front sight with fiber optic. Is optics ready? This one happens to have a Burris Fast Fire 4. The slide has a Cerakote finish. The back straps match that gray finish on the slide threaded barrel so we are going to oh by the way the finger grooves you know that i don't like finger grooves these are there but they're not there they're so slight that even a guy like me that doesn't like finger grooves agrees with these these are comfortable so i am going to set everything up we're going to be shooting about 10 yards with Fiocchi 9mm 115 grain going on full metal jacket going about 1200 feet per second and we, we're going to put some ears on. We roughly sighted this pistol in at about 15 yards but it was a rough sight in because it was too many of us. We didn't have a chance to sit there and do it. We only have three days of shooting so we didn't want to waste time sighting in. So everybody roughly sighted them in with the idea that we're going to come back home and sight them in and make sure they work for our reviews. So this is, these are the 20 round magazines. I only put 10 rounds in it. But now, by the way, after keeping them loaded for two or three days, I can put 21 rounds in it easily. Let's go ahead and do it. So other than the one that I dropped, I'm, I'm set up to shoot high, so I think I am, I think I'm there. I don't know, what do you guys think? You think I'm there? Yeah, I think so too. For 15 yards, um, I need to sight it in. Probably my elevation is off a little bit, but oh well, you know, who's counting? Um, these are the 10 round, uh, the 20 round magazines, like I mentioned in the video. They do have a 10 round magazine that is available for those uh, who live in states with magazine restrictions. And again, this Magwell, I miss it because it was very comfortable in my hand. I need to go ahead and order one so I can finish the review on it. But I'm I, this is a good setup for it. Uh, remember I told you how much I really like the full-size Stoger SDR-9? This one here, the Combat, it is, I tell you, this is a great setup. Um, I fired it for three days, basically two days. Uh, I did the shoot house with it. Uh, it was fun. The trigger pull in this is amazing for a very budget-minded striker-fired pistol. I tell you guys, this is a winner. You know, give us some thought. Is you, when you look at when you can find it on your store. This is a good buy, you know, for the price. The high capacity magazines, the 20, 20 rounders that come with it uh, for free states like us here. It's a good setup and a good match with the, with the Barris um, Fast Fire 4. Uh, we'll talk about the Fast Fire 4 later. We'll do a video specifically about it. But for this one, I think we're done for today. If you want to hear or uh, talk more about it, let me know. We'll, I'll take it with Freddy out to the range and we'll do some more shooting with it. But this is the first time at the range with you guys. I just wanted to show it to you. Again, guys, please like this video, share this video, and subscribe to the channel. And like always, please remain healthy, stay safe, and definitely have fun at the range. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews.